This is part two in a series of footwork for your trail foot. Now I want you to stand up straight and I want you to take your PVC pipe and take your stance. Remember your trail foot is supposed to be at a right angle about shoulder width and right angle to the line. Would you take this PVC pipe and put it across your chest and I want you to turn your shoulders. This is just a shoulder turn. Now I want you to notice the feel in the trail foot. When you get back here to this fully turn, you're gonna feel like your trail foot wants to slide out. You can feel it digging into the ground. That's what I want you to do. You just turn and feel like you're turning your trail foot into the ground. Imagine that someone's got you by your shoulders and they're screwing you down into the ground. That's the feeling I want. Your shoulders are screwing you down into the ground and your feeling of being screwed into the ground is in your trail foot. So just come back and turn your shoulders and screw your trail foot into the ground. That's the turn. That's the exercise. I said we're going to keep them small. That's the drill. Just turn your shoulders and screw your trail foot into the ground. Just feel it turning. Go all the way out to your max. If you don't feel that your foot is just about to slide out, then you haven't turned far enough. Just turn as far as you can and feel that trail foot screwing into the ground. It should almost be yelling at you saying, hey, you're about to lose your footing because you've turned so far. Again, this is why you need spikes. You cannot do this in tennis shoes. And you need to be flat footed when you do this. You need your heel on the ground and you need the ball of your foot on the ground. If you've got your heel off the ground and you turn, you're just gonna slide around. You don't have enough spikes in the ground. You need both in there digging into the ground. Just turn and feel that like that trail foot's about to slide out from under you. Now I want you to do this drill a hundred times. Remember, you should have a clicker with you. I've got one here. Everybody should have one, and I want you to do it a hundred times in five turn increments, like this. One. Two, three, four, five. Then take your clicker, click it five times. Don't do more than five at a time. People, it's been shown that when you do a few and then take a break that you learn more than trying to do them all the way through. But do at least 100, uh, counts of this drill i want you to do at least 100 of all the drills i'm going to show you it will really drill it in you'll get that feeling in and then you'll understand how to do it time after time after time so again you take the take your stance draw foot at a right angle both the ball of your feet and heel on the ground this is not about your toes don't get up on your toes you're going to be flat footed and then Make your turn with your shoulders. Two. Three. Four. Five. Again, feel like your trail foot is being screwed into the ground. That's the feeling I want you to go for. 